powerful. I am a cultural obsession coming home to roost. I am undead. I make no sense. Get too high. I serve no. Hey, what's up, home? Ah, you know, just uh, hunting for brains. Any luck? No, nah, not really. This is Vinewood. The only place they made the lobotomy mandatory. Well, I will say I know a lot of people that were killed for this job, but I'm gonna be straight up with you, dawg. It ain't true. Good luck. Thank you. I am the undead! I am the undead! City had a car. You, pal, we need your help. On your knees and stay down till we're gone. All right, all right, let's go, let's go. Lose the cops. What the hell was that? I said I had a score. I didn't say I thought of everything. Well, you could have thought of something. A car. Everyone in this shithole city's got a car. Go back to Liberty City, you Irish prick. You know where we'd be if this guy hadn't come along? We wouldn't be sharing the take is where we'd be. We'd be sharing a jail cell. You know, I ran big time hoods in LC. We took major scores. You can't even handle a drugstore? Oh, you and your stories. Shut up about LC. Shut up about the bank job and your family and your friends. I don't care. So at least I know I ain't the least competent crook in the city. I swear, it's just this guy. Look, man, can you just lose the cops? What do we do? Turn around. Ooh. These powerful guns. This kid's all right. Drop us around the corner, we'll give you your cut. Hey, look, uh, I know I seem like a hothead and an idiot. I am a hothead and a bit of an idiot. But I work, okay? And I can handle myself. I ran with some big guys in LC, and the only guy I know over here is him. If you ever hear of something, a score that needs bodies, would you think of me? All right, dude. If someone were to mention something like that, I got you. Right there. Good! There's your share, bro. Think of me. Pack him in the prairie of Duke's LC. Mm. We got him. Hey, how you doing? Ah, pretty good, under the circumstances. About to knock off a federal government building. Well, meanwhile, my psychotic former BFF is trying to figure out a way to kill me. But hey, the meds are kicking in. So life's good. Well, exactly. If Franklin got us what we need, put those on. Then what? Then head in there and uh, rig up a slightly more sophisticated fire trap than we've got here. Oh, I'm guessing drapes and scented candle aren't gonna do the trick, huh? No, 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 no. You will have incendiaries and a remote device. Now, they need to be strategically placed so we can ensure that we still have access to the server and that the structure maintains its integrity. Now, once you get out, trigger the bombs, meet up with Franklin and the crew, and we'll intercept the emergency call, and you all go in as firemen. Oh, got it? Yeah, I got it. Sounds a little idiotic. Well... Under the circumstances, it was the best I could do. And if you remember, you were the one who chose to do it like this. Oh, come on. But, you know, Trevor has a point about you. You whine too much. Yeah, fuck you. Oh, don't even try it. Don't worry.
right, what's happening, Michael? Ah, my shift's about to start down at the FIB building. You know, get Gustavo and Norm on board and be ready for my signal in the fire truck. Okay, at least half the crew is serious. But we'll be ready to do this thing, dawg. If you're new, just clear your pass with security, and you can go up. Yeah, they keep changing the contractors. Yeah, because guys like me keep losing their jobs and agreeing to do this for less. All right, head up. Dirty mop.
looks dirty. You know you stay too late when the mopping dead show up. All right, up. I sure wish I could get a high work. They don't work so hard. Building's closing any second. Hey, charge is set. I'm out of the building. Hey, dog, we right around the corner. We got your gear in here with us. Shit's in motion, people. We raiding the bureau. Y'all ready for this? In and out, Holmes. Let's do it. All right, trigger the fire bombs, Frank. I'll get my turnout gear on. Hijack the emergency signal, right? Yep. We'll be the only idiots running into that burning mess. So don't worry. Hold it up there by the curb. All right, let's get in there. Find the apartment here. Elevator, let's go. Come on, let's go. All right, Lester says these elevators should still be fine. Was he on that industrial strip painkillers or that hallucinatory weed at the time? Yeah, probably a little bit of both. Cool, dog. Thanks for clearing that shit up. All right, we're going across to the far stairwell and up to the top floor. We gotta go across. 
Take the stairs to the top floor. We take these up six stories. Server rooms on 53. Keep going. Almost at the top. Drives up here. F, the door's locked. Spit a bomb and blow it. It's hot, look out. Removable drive in the server stack on the far wall. I got the drive, let's go! We ain't got long! Follow me! Whoa, bad news! Get out of here! You fools should be at home! The office was 
was meant to be him! Stay done, man! I'm coming to fight! Awesome job! Hurry up! Oh, it's done. I'm on 50! Where are we going, man? Real. It's Frank! Alright, kid! Hey, we're going over this! Follow me! Mm. Plans show an elevator shaft this way! We can repel to the bottom! All right, this is our way out. We gotta get these doors open. What's up? Hey, give me a hand. Briggs, come on. I see it's street level. I fucking hope so. Okay, use controller. Get to the ride and torch this fire truck as soon as possible. I'm working on it. Yeah, because if they connect the dots, man, I don't know. Man, I'm working on it. Any minute they'll be looking for us. I mean, those guys in the building you took down. If they knew, who else is gonna know? It ain't worth thinking about, dog. Trust me. I'm gonna get us there as fast as I can. All right, shit. Shit. I just don't want to run into something. Man, y'all don't want to run into Trevor, bro. That's who you don't want to run into. Haha, <laughs> you're right. So, uh, Take us to our get-out, avoiding the cops, the feds, and my dear friend Trevor Phillips. All right, man, I'll try. Try real hard, okay? Cool. Drive us to Lester's. Now that we're clear, I can probably tell you people. I didn't think we were going to make it out of there. Uh, one of us didn't. We lost a dude, man. Oh, yeah, shit. I don't like speaking ill of the department, know what I'm saying? But that dude was in over his head. Yeah, he wasn't top draw, but I thought we could carry him through it. I guess I thought wrong. Well, anyway, we made it out. So we got that to be thankful for. 
Norm's people will get his paycheck and the standard expenses. Man, you really gonna miss him, huh? Hey, I don't like losing any of my crew. But, uh, Norm was special. He liked you, man. Yeah, he looked up to me, maybe. Man, when looking up to you, got that poor fool killed. Hey, this Lester crib, ain't it? Keep your heads down, you hear? <laughs> well. What? I never thought I'd see you clowns again. We did it! <laughs> Fucking A-Ray, we did it! Ow! How was it? For a suicidally dangerous mission impersonating emergency services while working a high security government facility, it was surprisingly uplifting. <laughs> <laughs> Come here. Give me oh. some of that. Hey. Ow, ah. ow, ow, ow. Oh. Sorry, I forgot. You forgot my very, very obvious illness? It happens. Uh, whatever. Hey, let's get drunk. Franklin, fill up the glasses. Got some real vintage moonshine, hillbilly type shit. We're gonna be seeing triple and committing incest in minutes. <laughs> just the shit to make a man forget his trouble. Oh, exactly. I am just gonna get drunk as a skunk, and then I'm gonna reverse engineer a webcam and spy on those sorority girls again. <laughs> I'm oh. ill, okay? Give me a break! Cheers! <laughs> <laughs> man, that's some foul ass shit! Oh. <laughs> All right, boys, I hate to break up the ritual, but I gotta go square things up with Davy and Dickwa. Uh, for serious? Hey, I just want them to know that now that we did this thing for them, and we have the evidence that we did this thing for them, that we can all go our own separate ways, you know? Well, fuck it. You want me to go with you, dog? No, stay. Have fun. I gotta do this alone. Right now. The sooner the better. It's one way to look at it, eh? Right. <laughs> Besides, I want to put this shit to bed. Then I can figure out Trevor, you know? Get my life back. Go back to being bored and miserable and loving every motherfucking minute of it. Here, enjoy the incest juice. <laughs> <laughs> Man, you boys sure know how to put the fun back in midlife crisis. Hey. We hit the bureau for you, Dave. I'm done. Yes, I saw that. Meet me at the court center and I'll debrief you. I'm out, Davey. From now on, done. I appreciate that. I'm trying my best for you, but, but you and Trevor attacking Merriweather? Repeatedly? It doesn't help. That's Trevor's thing. Whoever's thing it is, it's unauthorized and it's dumb. They've been sniffing around my office. We really need to talk. Really? <sighs> all right, all right. I'll come to the court center. Fuck.
Ricky from Life Invader. Bro, I know you'll find this hard to believe, but it's kind of difficult for someone with a middling GPA and bad references to get a job in this climate. You gotta help me. Hey, if there's something, I'll call you. That's all I can say. Good luck out there. Hello, hello. Good to see you, Slick. Devin. Devin. What the hell are you doing here? It's over, Michael. You done good, kid. You kept this bullshit up long enough to help me trigger a fantastic insurance payout when the plug is pulled. I love you. You're, you're like my spirit brother now. <sighs> Where's Solomon? He's out getting the negatives of film, whatever the fuck it is. The last dinosaur in town is about to get fossilized. What are you talking about? Look, the movie's nearly done, so if the plug's pulled now, the investors, meaning us, get a massive insurance payout. Meanwhile, I can use that to get the other major shareholder, the old bastard's idiot son, to agree to tear this relic down and let me redevelop the area for condos. <laughs> in this economy, the city's gonna let me build tax-free. I might even get some rebates. It is a brilliant thing, and it is all thanks to you and Molly's eye for the details of the insurance policy. Michael! They're fucking us! The suits! And they don't even wear suits! Wolves in turds clothing! Try not to take it too badly, Mr. Richards. Were you ever a human being? Look, people used to like films, now they like what? Videoing themselves, beating off on their iFruit phones. Don't blame me. I'm a very spiritual person. I feel badly about this. But evolution is evolution. Gentlemen, Molly. Namaste. Can I take the film now, Mr. Richards? My plane leaves in 25 minutes. Can't we do something? At least let me finish the picture, then close the place down. I'm afraid our timetable doesn't allow for that. Goodbye, Mr. Richards. Where the hell is she going with that movie? She is taking the only copy offshore, somewhere nice and discreet. Analog! God, it's certainly got its complications. Michael, can you do something? No, he can't do anything, pal. It's an inevitability. <sighs> My wife got screwed by a yogi. And now I'm getting screwed by a yogi? Fuck that! I'm a producer! Nobody fucks with my film! Okay, okay, the airport. down, Slick. You're not thinking. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my movie. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. Get to the airport, talk to her. That's it. They fucking scrapped it. No crazy we did at all. This fucking game is fucking scripted. Uh... 
Slow it down, Slick. You're not thinking. Hey, I'm a producer. I'm producing the goods. Don't do this, Slick. Think. She's got a police escort. She's on the way to my personal hangar. Security at the airport work for me. I just want to get the film back before she does anything rash with it. Molly's highly strung. She's not going to stop and talk it out with a deranged killer chasing after her. That ain't who I am today. Look, I don't want to hurt anyone. I just want to get my movie. Slow down and use your brain. Fun time is over. Ah. Really? Okay, Molly was escaped. It's not true. Oh, that was so bad. Fucking taxi over here and here. Come on. Stupid. Stupid game. What's she up to? Michelle, there is no need to panic. The LSPD are here to escort you to the hangar. It is, pal. She's totally flipped. Chicken? Stop your car! Stop the car, lady. Get off the runway now! That man's a murderer! He wants to kill me! Well. On the floor, lady! On the fucking clear! He kills people! Help me! Lady, you need a friend! I'm just a white collar criminal, but he's a hey, real hey, one! Hey, 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 Move! Stop. A madman's coming! Oh, stop! Look out! Oh! Ah, oh, that was nasty and needless! All right. Oh yeah, we're about to take film now. Yeah. How dare you, how oh, dare you. Hey, I want it, I got what I came for! I'm leaving! Hey, I ain't done anything!
a, 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 You are through to the exclusive personal line of Devin Weston. Mr. Weston checks the service twice a day, so leave your details and wait for a response. I just speak into the thing? What? This is a humiliation too far. No one in this town answers their own phone. And I'm supposed to be on my own answering machine? I loved you once, Tony, but there's nothing between us. Now that I know you prefer dictation. Really? We're doing this now? I just watched Devin Weston's legal counsel get juiced in a jet engine. Oh, that Molly woman? Oh, Lord, that's horrible. You have no idea. She panicked, went crazy, and ran into it. But I saved the print, so we still got our movie. You believe that analog thing? It's all digital. We have backups everywhere. I mean, we're shooting on green screen. Well, you could have told me. I'm sorry. Look, I thought you knew. The edit's nearly done, and we've got to get it out before they can screw us again. I've greenlit a premiere. That will stop them from burying us. A premiere? For Meltdown? Okay. Can you invite my family? They can finally have something to be proud of me for. Of course. It's already on its way by courier. All right. Shit. I'll get ready. It was an American divorce, by the way. The movie quote. Obviously.
Ah, see? Davey, that's why we're such great friends, huh? So we're old school, we like old-fashioned things. Newspapers, celluloid. Good guys, bad guys. We're friends? Well, I don't know, you tell me. We did what you said, right? Got those people off your back? Now you're gonna do like you said, and cut me loose, right? Things are not gonna work out quite that way. There's a bit of a problem. That's right, Davy boy, you could say that. Steve, I told you I would handle oh, this. Oh, because you've handled everything so fucking well so far, haven't you? All right, I admit things have been a little unorthodox, I'm but- fucking orthodox! You've ruined my career! Agent Sanchez, arrest these men, both oh, of them. Oh, Steve, Oh, whoa! On, please! You fucking kidding me? Arrest me for what? For multiple counts of every fucking crime under the fucking sun. Oh, well then let me rephrase. Why? Why? Because. Because you don't want me to testify in court about our various business dealings, right? Agent Sanchez, apprehend the suspect! Agent Sanchez, you'll do no such thing. Now, Steve, we agreed to speak to Michael, to try and explain things to him. Not this. This causes problems for us all. Okay, okay. Then put your gun down and we'll talk. After you, buddy. Come on, where's the trust? You can do better than that. They know or think they know that I'm the one that was behind the incident. Uh-huh. And now you want me to clean up your mess again, right? Before I end up at the bottom of the ocean. Fucking good luck with that. Put the weapons down, boys. Fun time is over. We've got you. Anti-American activity. Put your weapons down, all of you. Who the fuck are you with? With me. You fucking rat. I knew you didn't have the balls for this. For the record, I'm a patriot. I love my country. Put the weapons down. Oh. Fuck you. We all know you agency boys are ball deep in a plot to drive up your funding by any means necessary. Boys, the gun down, gentlemen. Who the fuck are they? Fucking Merriweather. What are they doing here? Steve, put your gun down. Oh, same goddamn leg. Go! Fuck! Bullshit. Mike, this your frequency. That's over here. Some more of these guys kill each other. Fuck me. What happened to Haynes? He get caught in the crossfire? Oh, the 
fuck? Hey! If anyone's gonna kill you, old friend, it's gonna be me! Oh! You here to finish the job, T? No, 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 I'm just here for the opportunity. Now run! Touching reunion and all, but I'm about to get jumped by a team of rogue agents. T, you got the vantage point. Give Dave a hand. This is the guy who iced Brad and would ice me? I'd be better off putting my sights on him. Haynes made it out of here, and there's another group of agents looking... You get into our shit. Right now, you're not in a position to let our only friend in the Bureau get killed. They got a hard-on for me. Hey, I need him gone. If I can help you, Trevor, check the reflecting pool. Without me, the Bureau will be on you 24 hours a day! Stupid asshole. You ain't worth a piece of shit! Damn! Rogue agents! Even more of them! They're still on me! You know how much attention you'll get if I go down today! There you go. Ah, oh, God. You. Without me, the Bureau will be on you 24 hours a day! I don't care, Dave. What else? You know how much attention you'll get if I go down today. You're trying to call it. We're in this together! Do me a Stupid. solid They got a hard on for me! I need them gone! Rogue agents! Even more of them! They're still on me! I can help you, Trevor! Stupid asshole. Oh, come on! Without me, the Bureau will be on you 24 hours a day! I can't see them. You know how much attention you'll get if I, I go down today. We're good. Moving up on the reflecting pool. Get down here, Michael!
Well, that was fun. What are you doing smoking, huh? Come on. No, no, no. That's bad for you, don't you know, huh? Yeah, well, maybe it's got a little something to do with being caught in the middle of a three-way firefight between two government agencies and a private militia. You know, it gets me a little stressed out. Okay, but we still need you alive, Mikey boy. I mean, you know, at least for now. Unless, of course, you have another surprise for me. Huh? Maybe something to do with another inappropriate friendship? Yeah, that wasn't exactly Dave's fault. No, no, no. He's just the friendly face of a corrupt government agency looking to further his career by dealing with an equally corrupt and full to the fucking brim with bullshit low rent hood. Listen, Trevor, listen, I've been meaning to... Uh, you know, I've been meaning to... I've been meaning to tell you, you know, I've been... What, homie? What do you been meaning to tell me, huh? That you stabbed me in the back or that you were, and always will be, a worthless wretch who deserves to be put under. Yeah, well, no, what the fuck, fuck did you day? come back for? Oh, you know why. Ah, oh, no, no, no. One last score, mm-hmm. And if it goes good, <laughs> guess what? I don't have to put a little bullet in your head, but if it goes bad, well, that's okay, too. Because then, you and I get to go to hell, and I get to spend the rest of eternity with you Tormenting you. Well, I guess it's on then. Yeah, I guess it is. Call Lester, let's go. On speakerphone. Hey, it's me. I know. How'd it go? Just fabulous. Ran into an old friend. Matter of fact, he saved my ass. Mm, we're all friends now. Suppose the group hugs out of the question? <laughs> he wants to, uh, still go on the final victory tour. All right, when it looks like it's a go, I'll contact you. And remember this, gentlemen. If we pull this off, we will be making history. Sorted, nasty, depraved history. But history, nonetheless. All right. There, you happy? Fucking thrilled. Don't forget, amigo. Keep my eye on you. Yeah. Dear Dr. Freelander Shrink. Yeah, dog. Ah, I don't want to do Dr. Freelander's job because. Mm. Hey, Shelly! I've heard that place has great salmon. You made it! Good! I saved you again, Davey! Again! So what are you gonna do for me about Haynes, the rest of the FIB, the IAA, and everyone else, huh? History's written by the living, okay? We can pin most of it on Agent Sanchez. I get that story right and the agency and bureau will back off. The problem we need to deal with is Trevor. Trevor? Why? Try Merriweather. Chinese gangsters, general insanity, and so on. I can spin Steve that you're controllable, but not Trevor. Steve? He's our wounded hero right now. I gotta cozy up to him, calm him down. Just get me out. <laughs> 